Native and Durfee basketball star Chris Heron is one of the most sought after speakers in the country. The former Boston Celtics battle with substance abuse has been chronicled in ESPN documentaries. And as he maintains sobriety, he continues to inspire others. Tonight, Heron spoke at Cranston East High School. Maury Hirschgordon was there. The Cranston Substance Abuse Task Force and Chris Heron teaming up on Wednesday night, providing the public a free event about substance abuse, advocating for treatment, and embracing the power of recovery. To have him come and speak with us tonight and speak to uh, our community was just essential. The local star in the 90s turned drug addict, turned motivational speaker, speaking in front of a sold out crowd at Cranston East High School. There's been this stigma attached to substance use that, you know, anybody who struggles from it, um, that there's no growth after. Um, my life began when I got sober. Community leaders and government officials welcoming the Fall River native, thanking Heron for his time to help their area. Most importantly, the hope that he provides because of his road to recovery and how he's now given back by sharing his story means a lot to us. And I'm proud to uh, have him here. There's help out there. There are people available, uh, and there is a genuine need by the community to help those affected by the opiate crisis. You know, the message is always prevention. I mean, that's where that's where it begins, right? Um, but there's also a message of hope and, and that recovery is possible. And I asked Chris, what makes speaking at home so unique and so special? He simply told me, these are the people that followed me growing up, the people that followed my career. It's now my turn to share my story to help those in need. In Cranston, Maury Hirsch Gordon, Eyewitness Sports. Thank you, Maury. Still to come.